Tonight, authorities launching a new manhunt for a second suspect believed to be connected to the Paris Friday the 13th attacks. Police say Mohammed Abrini is the man who drove one of the cars used to deliver ISIS team members to their targets, including a suicide bomber at the Paris Stadium. Abrini is captured on this security camera at a French gas station two days before the terrorist strike. He's pictured with Europe's other most wanted man, Salah Abdeslam. The search for Abdeslam expanded into northwestern Germany today after a tip from French investigators, but once again, police came up empty. Back in France came new and frightening revelations. According to the Paris prosecutor, the suspected ringleader, Abdel Hamid Abaoud, was on the verge of carrying out a second deadly assault in Paris, this time hitting a busy financial area. The two terrorists, Abaoud, and the man found with him in the apartment were planning an attack which consisted of blowing themselves up on Wednesday, November 18th or on Thursday, November 19th in the business district of La Defense. The plot was foiled, investigators say, when French authorities carried out this early morning raid in Saint-Denis last Wednesday. It may explain why those inside the apartment appeared to be so well-armed and ready as authorities moved in. The resulting firefight lasted an hour and nearly destroyed the building. Abaoud was killed in the assault. Police say his cell phone delivered a wealth of information, including calls he's believed to have made to the killers during the Friday the 13th attacks, possibly directing them as they zeroed in on their targets. The phone also revealed Abaoud's movements that night, indicating that he may have returned to the scenes of the massacres. Nerves remain on edge in Paris. Several metro stations closed, and there were several evacuations triggered by information authorities say they received. In neighboring Belgium, the entire capital of Brussels remains virtually shut down, as authorities fear they may be the next target of a Paris-style attack. Hundreds of troops and police continue to patrol the city streets in numbers not seen since the Second World War.